Turn green slime into power. Not science fiction. But it's working thanks to innovation. In tonight's Fox E report, Mike Bars introduces to an unusual fuel source. It's the thick green goo boaters love to hate. Algae gets a bad rap for sucking oxygen out of lakes and ponds, killing fish and threatening the environment. This isn't just lakefront people's problems. This is the water you drink. But the Texas-based company, Valcent Products, promises to turn green slime into gold. In a joint venture, scientists created Vertigro Energy. Inside these greenhouses is a state-of-the-art system. It's turning algae into biofuel. They're using light, water, and air to do it. Uh, I know that, that algae is the fastest organism, fastest growing plant on the planet, and it sequesters the greatest amount of carbon dioxide. At the same time, it produces a vegetable oil substance, which can be used for a variety of purposes. That's what you see flowing through these tubes. The beauty of algae is the fact that we can actually be selective about what carbon chains are coming out of it. So for example, if you want to make jet fuel, we can give you a strain of algae that's going to make a, the carbon chains that are necessary to manufacture jet fuel much more efficiently than you can any other crop. Developers say the fuel made from algae is an energy efficient replacement for fossil fuels. And it can be used in any diesel powered engine. A clean, green, cost effective solution for the future. If we took one tenth of the state of New Mexico and converted it into algae production, we could meet all of the energy demands for the entire United States. The EPA says the fuel made from algae does not pollute the air. One more advantage, it does not require vast amounts of farmers' cropland to produce. The federal government plans to research the benefits in the next year. Mike Bars, Fox News, Chicago. Okay, Mark.